Hello everyone. Today I have so much going on in this video. I'm going to show you how to make your very own rose gold. In fact, I'm going to show you how to turn any color into a metallic. I'm going to get back to the basics working on my symmetry and use nothing but dots. I'll be taking a look at different tools and I'll be trying to make a whole new design out of a very old design. All right, I'm gonna let all the specifics play on the screen. Don't forget, I have a load of helpful videos down in the description. It's gonna help you get these guidelines on here and show you how I prep this canvas. I'll also put a link to all the supplies I use during this video down there in the description. So just sit back and enjoy. Right now, I'm gonna pick some paint colors. The first thing I'm gonna pick is magenta and the second is my go-to gold Champagne Gold by Deco Art. I love this gold and it is perfect for what I'm about to do. Before I get started, I want to show you the tools I'm going to be using in this video. They're a little bit different than these tools that I use typically. Right after these tools were released, I got a set of them from Happy Dot and Company. I was hesitant to use them until I got another set from a very special subscriber. Darlene is just the sweetest person and she sent me a set of these tools. I am going to be brave and go outside of my comfort zone and I'm going to use these. Thank you so much Darlene. This means the world to me. I think it's so sweet how you thought of me and I know you're probably right. So let's take a look at these tools. I'm thinking that they might be just a little more precise and y'all know I'm working on my symmetry right now. So it's a perfect time to put these tools to the test. Let's take a quick look at the set before we get started. Upon first glance, I see this tool is just like my dotting stylus. I've never had a number four though, so that's gonna be useful. And this one, yep, looks just like my number two. There's another tool here that I don't recognize. It looks like a flathead screwdriver on both ends and I can only imagine that if we dot with them, they might make some pretty cool ovals. I don't know. I will try this one out another day. The rest of these tools look just like my dotting rods, except for there's a whole bunch more sizes. Let's put them in order and see what we got. The first thing I'm noticing is that the shaft of these tools is triangular. I guess that'll keep them from rolling around. Well, I guess that's true for most of them. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna try to organize these here on the screen and then we're gonna get started painting.
Now I'm going to show you how I made the rose gold. I'm going to use this magenta paint and mix it with a few things. I believe you can probably swap this magenta out for any color you want and have a fantastic colored metallic paint. But today, I'm playing with magenta and making a beautiful rose gold. Let's do it. I'll be using this iridescent medium from Liquitex. It makes any paint shimmery and sparkly with an iridescent finish, almost pearl-like. I want to mix it with the magenta. That way, magenta brings its own sparkle to the party when I get ready to make this rose gold. Let's do the entire process right now. Now, according to the label, this medium will work with all other Liquitex mediums. And since I can't quite get a good dip out, I'm gonna thin it a little bit with my usual flow aid and water mixture. I'll remove all the bubbles by giving this paint palette a little flick or two. Here's my favorite part where I mix the iridescent in with this beautiful magenta. Here we go. I know it's hard for you to see, but it is sparkly. The only thing we're missing is gold. Guess what I'm gonna do? Oh, you guessed it. Let's do it.
y'all what do you think about this i couldn't be more tickled with it this is a very old mandala design but by changing the colors up in there a little bit and playing with this rose gold and that gradient it looks like something i've never seen and how about these tools darling you totally knew what you were talking about i should have listened to you so long ago they have earned themselves a coffee cup at my desk alongside my regular tools. Y'all head to happydottingcompany.com and pick up a set of their tools. Either set is going to get you through my tutorials. While you're in the description, don't forget to check out those helpful videos. It's going to help you make art just like this. All of the supplies and everything are down there. Also, check out channel membership. Y'all, there are loads of perks and channel membership is growing every day. This week, I want to welcome our newest member, Sherry G. Thank you so much for joining. You have no idea how much that helps me out. I hope you find everything you need. If you don't, comment down below. I'm here to help. Okay, you guys, make sure you hit that like button and check and be sure that you're subscribed. I want you to watch these videos right here. And until next time, rock on.